Let's look at the titration of barium hydroxide with H2SO4 and try to predict the correct plot of conductance, that is the brightness of a light, versus the added H2SO4. Do you think that'll look like A, B, or C? Think about that for a minute and make a selection. Let's look at a possible explanation for each answer. A, the light will stay bright until the barium and hydroxide ions are used up, then will go out. B, the light will slowly get dimmer as the ions precipitate, but then excess ions from the acid will return the light. Or C, the light will slowly get dimmer as the ions precipitate, then stay out. Think about those three possible explanations and make a selection. We're talking about the conductometric titration of barium hydroxide with H2SO4. So we want to know how does the light intensity change with added H2SO4? Will it stay bright? Will it get dim initially and return? Or will it get dim and stay dim? Well, we have this on the bench top, so let's actually do the experiment. Here I have barium hydroxide in this lower flask, and I have H2SO4 in this burette. So I can start H2SO4 adding into the barium hydroxide solution, and as I do that, you'll notice a couple things. One, this immediately gets cloudy. That's the formation of the solid barium sulfate being stirred up in solution. And you'll notice something else. This light is getting dimmer. And if I'm very good, I can bring that light, I can use up all the ions, and just barely put that light out. I'm going to give another drop or two. So now I'm at the stage where I've used up all the barium ions and all the hydroxide ions and made barium sulfate and water. So the solution has very low ionic strength and very low conductivity. Now let's look what happens if I continue adding H2SO4. I continue to add H2SO4 and the light returns. Now the light returns because H2SO4 forms ions in solution. So initially I use ions up and after all the barium is used up then the extra sulfate that goes into solution stays into solution and allows the solution to conduct. So the correct answer here is B, I'll lose intensity, and then intensity will return as the sulfate increases in concentration. So H2SO4 lends itself to making an ions in solution and gives us a bright light. And after the solid is formed, these ions conduct. The correct answer here is B.